Welcome back to KSN News at 4 from the ICT to KC. Wichita's Blake Bell is headed to the Super Bowl. I want to bring in KSN's Jason Lamb now. For this story, we should have called you Lambdozer or something like that. Um, <laughs> Jason, Blake is not the first Bell out of Wichita to play in the NFL. No, he's not, but he is the first one to play in a Super Bowl or to at least appear in a Super Bowl. After Mike and Mark Bell retired from the NFL, they attended Kansas City Chiefs games with their kids, took them down to the sidelines, had easy access. They never dreamed Mark's son Blake would one day appear in two Super Bowls with the Chiefs. In the middle of Wichita's Delano district, the only twins from the state of Kansas to play in the NFL reminisce about the days after their playing careers ended. I think back back to times Mark and I would take our kids to the game, and when they were little, and uh, on the field in preseason, and and you know watch the games and, and do it every year. And then you know in the circle of life, here comes Blake, and he makes it to the NFL, and he actually makes it to Kansas City, which is unbelievable. Kansas City where Mike, number 99, was a fixture on the Chiefs defensive line for 12 seasons. His brother Mark, who played with the Seahawks and the Colts, beams when he's asked about his son going to his second Super Bowl. It's nothing like it. It's, it's a, I, I said the first time might be a dream come true. When you do it the second time, it's, uh, it's just hard to believe. It's hard to, it's hard to really put into words, but we're so proud of Blake and everything he's accomplished. Mark says Blake missed a big chunk of the season after tearing his quad muscle off the bone. Blake's back on the active roster now, and he's played in three games. Healthy just the right time, right when needed, right here in the Super Bowl, and go get our second win. Blake caught a touchdown pass against the Broncos on New Year's Day. He's one of four tight ends on the roster. The whole group in there is a, it's a good tight end group, and, and Blake loves being around with that team. He loves the Kansas City Chiefs. He loves that locker room, and uh, it's, it's been a great experience for Blake. It's just a special time right now for Kansas City, and, and, and Blake's in a special place, and I... I tell him that, I said, Blake, you're in a special place at a special time. He goes, you ain't kidding. The Bells traveled to Miami and saw Blake and the Chiefs win Super Bowl 54. And yes, they're going to Glendale too. We'll absolutely be there for this one too. I mean, we're looking forward to uh, another great game and another win for the Kansas City Chiefs and uh, experience everything with Blake. Well, we, we got to go. I mean, you know, you always wonder about it. It's, it's not a, a, a uh, it's an expensive trip. Uh, but I've chose to take the whole family. So we're going to, Mark's taking his family, I'm taking my family, and, and we're going to uh, enjoy the experience of a lifetime, you know, because we, we talked earlier, you, you never know. I mean, you know, the Chiefs are on a roll now, and it's a team you feel like can get there more than once, but you never know. Now, Bell has one reception in the playoffs. He was a healthy scratch in the AFC Championship game. And right now, I just checked a little while ago, he's listed third behind Travis Kelsey and Noah Gray on the Chiefs' unofficial Super Bowl depth chart. So hopefully we'll see him in action and get to play a few snaps on Sunday. Feel good about seeing him, man. Just from, from Bishop Carroll High School here in Wichita to the Super Bowl, it's a great story. Yep. All right, Jason, thank you Thanks. very much. Our